I'm Florina and I'm an engineering brand manager at LinkedIn. My name is Camila Taylor and I'm a software engineer at LinkedIn. Hi, I'm uh, Neha Nakede and I'm a software engineer at LinkedIn. I started my career at LinkedIn as a developer uh, just over four years ago and originally I came in to be a developer on the subscriptions team and after doing that for a few years um, I found myself doing more uh, more outreach kinds of things. So I was planning really cool activities for the engineers and the developers in the company. I was planning conferences, I was planning offsites, um, and over time that interest grew into actually a real role. So now my current role is an engineering brand manager, which means that I focus on things like branding and recruiting and culture. Growing up, uh, I, my first career dream was actually to be an astronaut. <laughs> Uh, and then my parents told me, well, if you want to go to space, you know, you have to do science. Uh, and then, so I was always actually surrounded by technology. My dad is a computer science professor. So I grew up with Barbies, but I also grew up with Legos. As a 10 year old, my first introduction to computers was uh, playing Prince of Persia on the very first version of Windows. Uh, I'm an artist and when I saw that what I could express on paper, I could express on Windows Paint on this little machine, that's when I actually decided that I want to uh, build a computer. I studied computer science at the University of the West Indies, that's in Jamaica, uh, and computer science and math. Then I decided to go to grad school, so I did a master's in computer science at the University of Illinois, Urbana-Champaign, where I actually studied robotics. Uh, that was a, a lot of fun. You know, I got to apply my love of math and computer science and physics and something physical. As part of my role, um, I oversee our incubator program, and the incubator program allows anybody to, that has any idea to take that to the next level, which means they can make a prototype and then they present it in front of our executive staff. And if they get the green light, they get up to three months to work on that project, which means anybody with any idea can work on anything they want. And this happens very, very quickly within a matter of three to six months, you can have something that you thought of yourself, you created yourself, and then you have it live on the site. I've only been at LinkedIn for about eight months. And already in these eight months, I've already worked on two products that um, are in production. The first one was uh, converting our desktop registration process uh, to the mobile experience. I was on a team doing this. The second product that I worked on is even bigger. It was on the new LinkedIn profile. It's the biggest uh, revamp of a profile since the original profile for LinkedIn. There are multiple tiers that form uh, a website. There are front end, mid tier, back end. I'm uh, working on the back end uh, at LinkedIn. Uh, here we build uh, software that helps LinkedIn scale to hundreds of millions of members uh, and hence it's very important that we get it right and durable the very first time and that's what is exciting about my job. I get bored very easily so I love my job because it's always different every day. Uh, it's creative, it's challenging um, and it's collaborative. I love my job because at LinkedIn we build opportunity. We build opportunity for ourselves and we also build opportunity for every professional around the world. We are really interested in how we can transform our careers and how can we be the best version of ourselves that we are right now, but also how we can get others to see that about themselves. LinkedIn addresses one of the most important problems I think that we have today, which is you know helping people find jobs and helping people groom and shape their careers. You know, this is, you'll see this on the news all the time about, you know, trying to do job creation. And LinkedIn is just about that. It's about connecting talent with opportunity as the, as the slogan goes. So I feel really good knowing that I work on a product that's helping people's lives. Women think, act, and operate differently. Uh, I don't know what part of this is biological or cultural, but women do on an average think differently. For example, women are more emotionally sensitive and empathetic that can uh, help them understand people better, make them very good managers. On the other hand, women are more design-centric, more detail-oriented, so they can help you not only look at the big picture in your product, but also get into the nitty-gritty details. And uh, having a company where people think differently is great for the company. So it's really important for girls to understand that they can help people around the world even through technology. And in fact, it's through technology that they can impact even more in greater numbers because they are now helping millions of people as opposed to just one-on-one. -on -one. Don't think of yourself as a female engineer. Think of yourself as just an engineer. Uh, programming is not hard because you're a girl. It's just hard because it's hard. 
um, I would say be persistent, be, uh, op uh, be open to asking questions as well as question people. It's very important to if, uh, communicate effectively. Understanding technology and understanding how technology works and how computers work um, is going to help you in every single area of your life. So don't give up and keep going.